Yo, what's going on you guys? It's Meta Knight and Info here, back with another video today. And welcome back to Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order. In the last video, we traveled to the planet of Zepho, and we are currently investigating the current whereabouts of not only Cord Jedi Master Cordova, but also we've discovered in the last episode that the Empire is after something in Zepho. And now our mission is to figure out what are they looking for, how to get it first, and to get to the next location since we have to follow a pathway in order to unlock the vault we unlocking the jedi holocron so now we're going to go ahead and continue where we left off let's go ahead and begin or rather without further ado let's begin so i believe where we left off in the last video we were um in the middle of that temple or wait no it was a tomb actually my mistake not a temple, we, we left off in that tomb where we just presumably a dead Zephyl lies in. And apparently there's something within that we need to discover that Cordova ended up finding. The question is, what is that? What exactly is that that we're trying to look for? Or rather, what is it that Cordova, uh, what is it exactly that Cordova found that we should be of interest in? Alright, we're back inside. Or rather, we are back in it, so... As we can tell from our hollow map, the only way we can go is this way right here. So I guess that's what we gotta do. So... Oh, I thought we could climb up that. No, this is the ice. So we can't climb on that. We can't climb on these rocks either, apparently. There's gotta be a way for us to go over there. So those red areas we cannot access because probably presumably we're missing a force ability. But clearly our way inside is through that door, which we cannot open. If only we had like force pushers push or something rather, uh, this would have made things so much more easier, I think. Okay, right, so we have to figure out a way to get up here. That appears to be the only way that leads to, um, that leads to somewhere anyway. Maybe it's a shortcut that leads into that door, possibly. You'll never know unless you find out, so we're gonna find out right now. So, first off, let's go ahead and break these bases. Right then, so what have we got? What? What? Whoa, whoa, what the heck is that? That's like a giant automaton. So what do you call it? What do you call those like giant statues? That oh, sh. Yeah, that was a bad idea. Right. I need one! Alright, you use them beating. Alright, this like... Oh, what the heck? I think I have a laser beam? Ah. Okay. Ah. Okay. Oh, I avoided it sometimes. Ah. Ah. Alright, BD, what is this thing? Go ahead and scan him for me. So it's an enemy, obviously. A tomb guardian. Okay, so that thing is not like an automaton, like I said. If you guys don't know what an automaton is, it's basically like a, a statue, but it has like a, like, it basically functions like a robot would, if that makes sense. That's probably like the best way I can describe it without confusing you guys completely. Even though you guys are probably already confused as this. Okay, so we can't climb on this. This leads to somewhere. Okay, so this is like a ramp or something. Can we climb up here? Maybe? We can. So something goes right here. Maybe it's another one of those like ball things. Like that you see that like giant ball over there? Maybe that's what it is. Hmm. Alright, so we can climb up this. Let's go ahead and do that. Let's climb up here and see if we find something. Anything BD? Hmm. There's another slot right here for another ball. The question is where does it go? There's no way up this for what it looks like. Doesn't look like there's any way to climb up there. So, what is our move then? Okay, so the key obviously has to be. This. Oh wait, look, there's another door right here. Let's open it. Ah, let's open it. That pushed. It. Ah, look it. That pushed the ball into place. Can climb up this? You can. So the ball is a key that functions certain pieces of that unlocks pieces of the tomb. Okay, so, is this the... Yeah, look, that's the way. Yeah, let's slice these up first. And then, let's go ahead and get these out of the way. Let's go 
doing slice but not the way we would like to. Okay. Right, so this appears to be the way. Does this lead to anything? Is there anything else that we should be interested in? Alright, let's go ahead and get to the force point so we can save our progress. Right now, let us all meditate with the force. Let us become one with the force. Not really, we're not ready yet. Alright, now that that's done, let's go ahead and enter that doorway. And let's figure out what is on the other side. And I almost fell. Okay, first. Now let's go ahead and jump on. And let us enter through that passageway to see where it leads. Okay, right, let's climb back up. Let's go ahead and make our way back. Now that we cleared all that stuff, all those like rocks from into the two. Oh no, it's another slide. Another ice thing. Ah! Okay, where is that supposed to lead? Right here? Nope. That just led us to our death. Alright, there's something I'm missing apparently. Is there... Do I have to turn? Nope. Because there is no passageway that allows me to turn. Okay. Wait, there's a rope. Ah, oh, shoot. Dang it. Okay, so now I know that there's a rope. I didn't notice that before. Alright. So apparently, we have to swing across, wall run, and then get to that other door. Okay. Right, we just need to get that rope. Ah! Oh no, it's not too early. Oh no, I got it anyway. Alright, we just need to swing across. Ah! Alright, come on. There we go. Alright, we did it, right? Okay. Let's go ahead and slice up these uh, old bases. Only two million years old, or maybe even older than that. Maybe like a few million more years old. Okay, right, so the next doorway is up ahead. So this is where we need to go. Alright, there's more things in our way. Okay, right. Man, these bases are easy to break. All of them are great. Okay. So there's another hole right there. Okay, so we need to try to jump. But the air, if you guys remember from the last episode... It, oh, shoot! I can't climb up. Alright, we can climb up this. Okay, so the air is going to push us, so we have to jump slightly to the left so we can re reach it, I think. Alright, we can't slow it down. I was just trying it just in case. Alright, we need to drop slightly to the left. We should be able to... There we go, see? Alright. Oh no! Uh, I didn't know what this was at first. It feels quite cranky with that gross looking. There are monsters we gotta kill as well. Anyone else help these giant plant things? Alright, BD, give me a step. Alright, that appears to be all that's left. Okay, right. So apparently, the next way we gotta go is this way. Something above that we should be interested in apparently. Okay. Question is, does this lead to that room that we need to go to? The tomb of Elran. Did I say the name of the tomb in the last episode? I can't remember. Let me know in the comments down below. Okay, right. I need to jump uh I hear more of those plant things that are gross. Literally they uh I'm getting the chill just by thinking about the way they expand and the sound they make. I hate it so much. Okay. And oh shit. Ugh. Alright. Alright, now we need to jump across here. Ah. Okay. Jump up. Up here. Alright. Now we need to wall run across. Okay. I don't know why it was delayed there, but here we go. Ugh. More of these things. Okay. So there's two ways we can go. There is, um, one way over here. Ah. Hmm. Alright, let's slow it down. Let's go ahead and enter inside. Alright, here's a force point, so let's go ahead and meditate with the force. So if we die, we can immediately respawn here. We don't have any force points, so let's go ahead and, uh, First off, let's go ahead and do this. So that way we recharge our stems, and then let's leave. Okay, right. The bad thing is now that thing is in front of us. Alright, slow it down. Ah! 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 Get out of my way! Ah! Ah! It's gross. Help me, BD. Alright, I'm gonna need it. Okay, right. 
Apparently the only way is to jump across. Ah. Ah. Hmm. Is there another way? There has to be something else to this. Alright. Question is, there's an oh shoot. Alright. I'm gonna jump back over here. There's gotta be another pathway, because it doesn't seem like we can get over there somehow. I think the distance is too far. Because if you look at very closely at the hollow map, I don't think I can jump across that far. There's gotta be something I'm missing. The question is what? Okay. There's nothing else we can do except go back the way we were. I can't jump across because, yeah. I knew that was going to happen, but I was going to show you guys just in case if you guys were thinking that I couldn't. Okay, it doesn't appear like there's any other way, but what the heck? I pressed A too early! Okay. Right, so, it doesn't look like there's anything else if you guys can look, so. The only way up is right here. I have no choice but to go back to the way uh, where we were. Okay. Right, there's a lot of these things, this question. Okay. Oh, wait. First off, let's slow this down. Let's slow all of these down. I'm actually gonna try to jump across and see if I can make it somehow. I don't think that's possible, but I'm gonna try it anyway. Ugh! Oh my god. Oh my god. Ah! Ah! Thanks. Alright, BD. Yeah. We're gonna jump across anyway, see if we can make it. And. Nope! Yeah, we, we cannot. Ah! That's what, what the heck am I doing? Alright. At least, maybe with a running, a bit of a running start. Nope, we still didn't make it. And I got no stamina. Yeah, no stamps. Yeah, so we're in trouble here. We need to figure out what, what we're missing. Here. So, ah, I was trying to jump over it, but I ended up jumping on top of it. Damn it! Okay, right, respawn. Okay, so clearly there's a piece of the puzzle that we're missing here. We need to figure out how to get across to that door. Because that's apparently the only way to get across. But the question is, how? Like, what are we missing? Is the question. We need to figure that out. And hopefully we don't spend too long doing this. Because last episode, I think we spent a little too long. I spent a little too long. Not only screwing around. Uh, messing up. But also, um, I didn't get much progress done. On the, I don't think. I'm pretty sure if you guys were to make... Rate, oh, I'm back here again. I'm pretty sure if you guys were to rate me between 1 to 5. I'm pretty sure I would get like a 2. For last episode's progress, because I was screwing around and dying so much. Wait, what's that beam of light? You guys see this? Ah! What is this? Hold on, let me slow this down first. You guys see this, right? Life force and XP restored. Ooh, that's cool. Did I see any of anything like that in the last episode? Ah! Okay, so, maybe if I get more of a running start, I will count more distance. Nope. Same result as before. Okay, so that idea will work. Okay, right. You can, you can. That's the only bad thing is that I have to constantly keep getting rid of these things. Alright. Um, let's see if I can... Uh, maybe I get closer? Oh yeah, I did get a little closer, but I'm pretty sure that's not the way to do it. Okay. Yeah, this has to be like something I'm missing. Okay. Hmm. It doesn't seem to be any other way leading to the doorway besides, you know, this ramp that I'm currently on. And who knows what um, that doorway even leads to once we enter it. Right, so. I'm gonna go back into the force point and maybe uh, rest a little bit. Alright, let's go ahead and meditate with the force. I still don't have any force points, I'm just gonna rest real quick to restore my health. So I don't have to use up uh, too many stems. Okay, now that's done. Right. Now let's go ahead and... Um, there's nothing else in this room as far as I can tell. I can't slice anything here. So there's nothing here of interest, I don't think. Yeah, there's nothing else here besides the force point. And this, um, that passageway, it doesn't lead to anywhere. Okay, so there's something we're missing. There obviously has to be like a clever way to do this. But obviously, I'm 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 a, bit, I'm a little too stupid to figure it out. Apparently, all right, let's jump over this thing. Ah, oh, he's. See, I hate these things. Okay. There's nothing that passes through. I don't think we can climb on it, but we can try though. Nope. Yeah. 
There's no way to get on that passageway, so that won't work. Um, okay. What else are we missing here? Oh, no. I jumped back down here again. I didn't mean to do that. Yeah, look, there's no way we're going to be able to get across. Even if we try to jump over across, um, we're going to get pushed back by this doorway. Oh, yeah, that's right. Arrested, so that means the enemies over there respond. Yeah. There's no other way. We're going to have to go back up and try to figure out. There has to be something right there at that little ramp section where all those, like, uh, ugly plant things were. There has to be something there that, um, that will pretty much, like, solve this issue. It's like, why I can't get across it. What? Dang, I, I didn't jump to correct this. Right, let me do it. No, Cal. 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 Alright, let's jump over here. There we go. Alright. Oh, I hate the sounds. I hate the sounds that those plant things make. It's gross. They sound gross. Okay. We can't jump in here, obviously, because if we do, we're going to die, so... There has to be something I'm missing, but the question is, what? What am I missing? And why am I missing it? Like, what made it so well hidden that I couldn't figure it out the first time? Or right away? Okay. We can't jump from here because... Well, we could try, but... Yeah, no, that didn't work. Okay, so scratch that idea. Because I kind of thought that the wind would probably blow me forward. And... Oh yeah, it kind of worked there, but I'm costing my health though. Alright, maybe if I... Um... Nah, no, you know what, forget it. I was going to give it a third attempt, but it's not worth it. Okay, right. So, something up here is what we should really be interested in. Alright. Alright, there's something over here. Oh my god, there was a freaking door here. Ugh. This lightsaber can't solve everything. Yeah. That 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 should have been like Jedi Central number one at that point. Oh look! Alright. There we go. Alright, now we figured it out. So we had to open that door so the wind can push us That's what we were missing. See, why am I so dumb that I couldn't figure that out? I feel like I think I should. But I'm not the brightest guy. Alright. Oh yeah, this is the way. Okay. Oh no, there's another Tomb Guardian. It looks like we're gonna have to fight him. Alright, slow him down. Alright. Alright, slow him down. Alright, that's just it. Alright. Let's go ahead and uh, climb up here. Alright. Yeah, this is the way. We need to go over here. I'm assuming that this air pocket that we were looking at just a second ago will boost us up, right? Maybe? Maybe we jump. There we go. Oh, no, there's another. Oh, look. There's another echo of the force through there. But I can't access it. It sucks. Alright, we're up here. Now what? Alright, we go again. Maybe. There's gotta be a way to get across. Damn it, I almost had it. I almost had it. I better be careful of that plant thing so it doesn't explode on me. Okay. Alright, so we need to be very, very careful. Very, very careful. Okay, right. Let's get this out of the way. There's something over here, right? I think. Okay, right. So, right here's where that passageway is. But now what? Hmm. Oh, we can just go through it. Okay. Right then, so. Now where are we? Oh, we're in the room. This goes right across. Nice. Okay, right, so we should just go through the head, right? All breaking these old bases while we're at it. Even though I'm probably disrespecting this. Okay, yeah, right, nothing over here that's like too dark, so. Kinda of pointless for me to use my lightsaber. Okay. So I'll just go on ahead. Huh? What is it, BD? See something? BD? What's this? Nice job. Ancient statues. Alright, we can't climb on this. Or we can actually. I didn't think we could. Alright, we can't actually. We can't slice it up with our lightsaber. Either. So we should be in the room now, right? Yep, this is the room. Okay, right. Oh, wait, what? Oh, we're stuck. We can't open that door, apparently. And that's the way in. 
Oh, great. Oh, whoa. There's huge amounts of force energy here. Let's listen to this echo of the force. Maybe it will tell us something. Hmm. Whoa. What's going on? What is this? Is this a, is this a force vision? Or something? Ah! Oh. Oh, there's another flashback from the Clone Wars. I do not seek aggression, but we stand against it. The Force is there to shield us. The obstacles in your path define the path. What stands in the way becomes the way. Now, try again. Push the ball towards the front. Oh, so we're try again. So we're learning Force Push. Nice. We could really use this ability. Okay. Continue. Right, so we're relearning force push. Okay, good. So that way we can faster use now. It. Complete the test. All right then, master. Right. All right. It stands in the way, becomes the way. All right, nice. We know force push now. Nice. So now, oh, whoa, what's this? Oh, we can use the force on it. Okay. Oh, look! All the doors that were uh, apparently sealed off, we can now have access to. Let's go ahead and open this one door that was right here. Right here. Let's get rid of this. Right. Where does this lead? Anywhere? Hmm. There's another pathway over here. Oh, look! That's the same thing I forced pushed earlier. Alright, so we need to go back over there and push it down. So then we can use it to climb up, right? I think? You never know unless you find out, so we're gonna find out right now. Oh, this is cool. I'm actually learning stuff. I'm actually figuring out the puzzles. Oh, wait, no, that's the wrong thing. Here. Oh, wait, never mind. I thought that light was for sure it. Anyways, here we go. Okay. Right. Oh, no, there's this one. Okay. Now we can use it and mess with it with the force. Okay, right, so we need to get it over there, so we should be able to force push it over there now. Now that we've learned the skill, we need to make good use of it. There we go. Can we climb? Yes! And there's a force point right here, too. Alright, BD, let's open this chest. Let's see what this is. Hey, now. And the end there? What's that thing, one? Ooh, light tipper material, silver, Sylveon iron. Alright, let's listen to this echo of force. This guardian was destroyed long ago. So, Cordova maybe? When you came here? Probably, I think. Okay, right, now, let's go ahead and open that door. We should be able to open it with the force. Door. But actually, you know what? Let's go back to that other room and let's go ahead and open that other door that we couldn't have access to. Let's go ahead and do that. Okay, we can't force push that. Is there anything else here? Yeah, look, there's one door over here that we can force push. Let's go ahead and open it real quick. Let's go ahead and head back over here. Alright, BD, just watch your head. Alright, we can't force push that. Alright, so the door should be right down here. Where that ugly plant thing's at. Right? Yeah, it's right underneath us. Okay, right, we just need to be careful for the plant thing. Alright. What? I can't. I should be able to force push break, like, use the force to break it, right? Maybe? No, yeah, there's no mistaking it. I should be able to open it. Hmm. There's probably another... Yeah, there's probably... There probably has to be, like, another puzzle to this. Like, why we can't open it. Probably there's something we're missing again. Hmm. Oh, wait. That thing explodes, right? What if I could use it to blow up the wall? Alright, let's wait for it to regenerate. Alright, let's try it. Yeah, there we go. Alright, now let's listen to this Echo of the Force. See, this is awesome. I'm learning enough puzzles. I'm getting smart. Maximum force is Oh, three out of three. Offering to the wind. Awesome. It was destroyed intentionally for some reason. Right, so we discovered another secret. And I'm actually becoming less stupid. I'm actually becoming smarter. Who would have thought? But anyways, right. Let's go back to what we were actually supposed to do. Let's go ahead and get that door open. Now that we've opened that door, 
And now that we know the force push, we should be able to break those doors open. Right? Right. Okay now, right. Let's go ahead and open this door right here. Now there's nothing stopping us from opening it. Let's go ahead and open it! We did it. Whoa. Is that the tomb? Alright, there's another door in front of us, but look at this thing. What is it beating? Is this something from Godova? Objective complete. Oh, yeah. Friend, take a look at the detail on this bark. Bark? Like from a, a tree? distinctive striations. It can only be a Rosha tree from Kashyyyk. Oh, snap, Kashyyyk. It's time to call on an old friend. If the Zepho had contact with Kashyyyk, there is a good chance Chieftain Tarful will know about it. Tarful. Hmm. In case you all know what Kashyyyk is, Kashyyyk is the Wookiee planet. So, if you've ever heard of Chewbacca, you'll know what a Wookiee is. Alright. Oh! Oh shoot, there's another Guardian. Alright, let's take him down. Ah! Alright. Ah! Alright, we're ready to fight. Ah! 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 Oh shoot. Alright. Alright, we almost got caught. Oh, the thing is destroying everything. You're gonna stop it. Alright, slow down. And keep it up. Ah! Oh wait, I didn't get hit. Okay. Alright. Ah! Alright. Alright. Can we force the death, maybe? Alright, no time. Oh, nice, we got it. Awesome. Alright, we can't slice these. Okay. Right, so. BD. BD? Where'd you go? Oh, you're gonna scan the coffin? This is a coffin, right? A sarcophagus? Good it job. is. So it's Ilrim sarcophagus. So I was right, that is a sarcophagus. AKA a coffin. Alright, nice, we opened the door. Oh, snap. This lead back out here. Destiny unlocked, destination unlocked, Kashyyyk. Nice. Now that we know the force push, we can open these doors. Right then, let's go ahead and meditate with the force so we can save our progress. Alrighty. New skills are available. Healed connection with the force. Nice. Very, very nice. Okay, right now. We have new force abilities. Very, very good. Okay. Enhanced force recovery. Yeah, let's get this one. There we go. Force regeneration increased. Nice. Now we have we can uh, we will be able to regenerate our force more faster. Now let's go ahead and rest. Life force, dim canisters have been restored, enemies have respawned. Okay. Right, let's go ahead and now. Now that's done. Let's break open this door right here. Ah! Okay. There's something over here. Alright, let's go ahead and have a look. Ah! Alright. Ah! Ah! Let's climb up here, see what's up. Okay. Let's climb up here. Alrighty. Oh, there's a rope. This is this leads back into the, the sarcophagus room, or the tomb more specifically. Almost the entire thing is a tomb. All right, we need to get across there. Okay, no problem. Ah! All right, got it. Now we just need to shimmy across, and then we should be able to figure out what's interesting over here. Oh look, it's another echo of the force. Let's have a listen. This was deliberately destroyed. You can still feel the hate of the act. Ah. So, broken artifacts. Hint of the dark side, maybe? Alright. Now that's done. Let's meditate once again with the Force. So, it's possible that even a dark side user could have been here as well, which isn't really good in our case. Okay, right. We should be able to break open these doors now. Okay. Let's have a look. Alright. Can we break open this? No. Hmm, we probably need something to break it open because it doesn't look like we can break it open by ourselves. Oh wait, the ball is going blue. Yeah, look it. So does that mean, first off, let's close the door real quick. Okay. Well, I, can I use the force push on it? Yeah, I can. It can go to another spot, right? Or maybe I can use it to break open that door right there. Alright, let's give it a try and see if that works. See that another Nah, it doesn't seem like it's doing anything. So it doesn't look like the ball is the answer. 
Okay, right, so that didn't work. Okay, let me see if I can... Okay. Because there's more slots over here, and maybe we can use all these guys. Oh wait, no, that's another ramp. Oh, I know the Guardian's back. Okay. Right. There's no way up. Right, we need to fight. Alright. Oh jeez. Alright. Gotta be prepared. Right. Oh no. Oh, I barely escaped that thing. Right, so that was a close call. We nearly avoided our laser. Alright, we can use the ball as a shield. Or maybe we can use it to damage it. Oh shoot. Nope. That didn't work. Okay, so we can use the ball as a weapon. Okay, slow down, get out of its way. Ah! Dang, we still got hit. Twice. Oh, no, later. Ah! Wait, what? What? What the heck is that? Energy burst? Ah! Let's get out of its way. Ah! Oh, crap, we're getting beaten. Ah! Oh, damn it, we died. I could have sworn I avoided it, but it turned around and gave me a freaking cheap shot. Damn it! Okay, but I am getting better, aren't I? I'm learning to become a better duelist, I think. Right? I swear though, if this was the Force Unleashed 2, I would be wrecking everybody. Force, I would be blasting everybody with Force Lightning, tossing my lightsaber at people's heads, things like that. I would probably absolutely be destroying um, Stormtroopers, but this isn't the case. We're, barely, we're only a Padawan, so we're less skilled than Starkiller was in the Force Unleashed 2. Speaking of which, is there any more Star Wars games you guys would like me to play? Let me know in the comments down below, and your suggestion may be picked. Okay, right, so... Sorry guys, I'm eating chips. Right. So we're back here again. We can't open this door. We need to figure out a way to do that. And also that Guardian is going to be back, so... We gotta be prepared this time. Okay, right, let's go ahead and wall run across here. Or not. Don't know why we failed. Alright, this time let's go ahead and leave the ball inserted to where it is. Alright. Roll one across. Okay. Right then. Now let's go ahead. Ah. Give it a good push. Alright. Maybe we could use this to destroy the wall. Right? Especially since there is a ball um, chained up inside of it. So maybe this is the what we're supposed to do. Alright, let's go ahead and grab on. Or not. It's fine. We can just, uh... Oh, we can break this. Right, what's back here? Anything? What is it, BD? You see something? Yeah, there's something here. What is it? My friend. Oh, it's Cordova. This tool is utterly fascinating. What have you found, Master? Oh wait, that's it? It's just, you're just expressing fascination. Hmm. This tomb is definitely interesting, I will give it that. Alright. Yeah, maybe we can... Oh, um, I don't think I... Think there's maybe more spears around here? Me too. Let's keep checking. So those walls are the key. Okay, right. Here's what I'm thinking, guys. Maybe we could use this one right here, this ball that's trapped. We can use it to break down the wall over there. Maybe that's the key. You guys see how like it, it's like correlated right here, right? Maybe we can use this to break it somehow. Because look, if you guys remember, we couldn't do it by ourselves. So maybe something as big as the thing chained up could do it. Alright, let's get back up here. I was just showing that off as an example. So I know uh, where I'm going with this. Alright. Alright, let's go ahead and push it and see what happens. Oh yeah, look! I did it, I broke it! Alright, so now we have another bowl right here. There we go. Alrighty, look it. We got another ball right here. Wait a minute. Oh, I have to push the ball back. See, look, now we have two of these, right? So we can put one in one of those extra slots that we saw, and then with this extra ball, we can put in the other slot. Alright, I'm gonna put this one in the first slot. This is it where that other ball was? There we go. Alright, that made these steps up here. So now with this ball, what we can do is we can put it in one of those like, extra slots right here. Alright, so if you guys remember, this is the pathway that led us up to that secret entrance. Alright. Alright, let's go ahead and climb back up. This is that one area that led us to the tomb. 
Okay, great. So now, we need to find a way to guide... Alright, we can't slow that down. We need to find a way to guide that ball into this slot or one of the other extraditional slots. But real quick, I just want to double check and see... Are there any other areas in Tomb that we uh, missed that we could force push? Let's go ahead and double check real quick. Just in case to see if there's anything here. Alright, slow down. Let's go in. Let's get rid of that thing. And then... Oh my god, I feel so good at that. Especially since I hate this thing so much. But ah! Cheap shotter. One more. Right then, sorry about that little cut in, but back to the search. Alright, that's the end of it. Now back to searching. Right, you guys, so I went across the whole tomb again, as you guys kind of saw there, and uh, I didn't really find any other doors that we missed, so I think we got everything for the most part. So. Real quick, I'm gonna go ahead and save my progress since uh, even though I didn't really find anything, we don't want to lose our place, so let's go ahead and save our progress. Okay, now that's done. Now, it seems like the only thing we have to do is figure out um, how to... Uh, There's gotta be another spear somewhere. Yeah, so it had to do with these balls, but basically we're trying to find like a door out of here, I'm guessing, since we need to get back to the Mantis and get to Kashyyyk as soon as possible. First off, is there anything else here that we should take into consideration? Doesn't seem like. Since you're climbing up this, that simply just goes back up there. But if you guys remember from when we looked up here, there was another slot across. If you guys remember. So that's one thing we need to do. We need to figure out how to get one of the balls there. Because I'm pretty sure it means it'll unlock something. On the other side. We just gotta figure out how to do it. Oh no, the guard is back again. I thought I destroyed you. Alright, get out of the way. Damn, I still got hit. Slow down. Damn, this thing is alive. Come on. Turn, ah. Turn you into scrap. You oversized tin can. Alright, that's the end of him. Hopefully for good. Hmm. Is something through here? We can't break it with the force, so that's definitely not enough. We can't climb through it either, apparently, because it's like too narrow or something. Hmm. Right then. So what are we missing here? Alright, let me think. Alright, we can't force push this. This is another ramp. And we can't push that in. It's like embedded in place. Not much else for us to look for. So, simply put, we need to find more of these balls and then get them into the slots. Okay, where's the one that was right here? Oh, wait, I put it in that one in the... Oh, okay. Nothing over here. I don't think, right? No, yeah, there's nothing. We checked everything that was in here. <gasps> Sorry, here you go. Um, so there, there's nothing in here that could really help us, so we just need to figure out the last piece of the puzzle. And then we should be able to escape the tomb, right? Maybe? Alright, there's nothing over here. Over there, this thing can't really help us out anymore. Okay, but there's no point in climbing on this thing because that's just gonna lead to the top, and we can't slice this off either, so that won't help. Hmm, there must be something here we're missing, or what exactly? We can't even force push it anymore. Can we still use this? Um, we can, but that won't really do us any good. That just takes us back to the force point. So, that doesn't really do anything. 
Right, so... Go oh, ahead and climb back up. Alright, let's go ahead and shut the door. Alright. Might as well swing across just cause. And that was good. Okay. I should have been able to slow it down. Oh, oh wait, no, that was a push, my bad. Alright, it ran out of force. So we can't really use the force on it anymore. Alright. Let's get back with us. So yeah, this just leads back to the point, like I said, so this way it won't work. Or that idea won't work. We might as well go ahead and save our progress anyway. Okay, right, so, we need to figure out how to escape. That door is the only way that we can. The only question is, how do we unlock this door? And I think that structure right there is the elevator we saw earlier, where we got into the tomb, which is also a way out, I'm guessing. Which means that there has to be something that I missed, or that I'm missing, rather. Maybe this way? Okay. Oh sh I really need a stem. Alright, appreciate it, BD. Okay. There's nothing else here, it's just that one secret room that we found earlier. Which on its own there is not really much in here. Okay. Nothing else here besides this. Yeah, we can't get up there because that's involved with the ice. And we can't climb on top of ice. Okay. I'm just like double checking every room I can access for right now. Just in case if there's anything else I missed. Besides um, the main, uh, you know, that we gotta escape and stuff. There's nothing else in the secret chamber here. We already uh, gathered this echo of the force. But, we didn't get this one here. Let's go ahead and have a look. Wait, it's not what? just wind rippling through these chimes. Voices. From the past? Then that must be the voices of the Zephyr. Probably. Alright, we can't move this ball anymore. It's stuck in place, so we can't use that as like a third sphere. Uh, for like a slot. Okay, right. I just wanted to make sure, because I remember this from earlier. Right, so there's nothing else for us to explore. So, we just have to figure out this puzzle in the main chamber here. And then by doing so, we should be able to escape from the tomb. Or exit the tomb and get back to the Mantis, because we need to get back to Kashyyyk. Or we need to get to Kashyyyk. But if I remember from the Star Wars The Force Unleashed, even though that game is legend now, which means it's not canon anymore. Though, no, regardless, I think uh, Kashyyyk is under the Oh, good. Down. Ah. That's the end of him. Alright, let's climb back up. So there's nothing else for us to explore in the tomb. Okay, that was one of the other things that I knew. I searched the other side of the tomb uh, earlier. Okay. There's got to be another spear somewhere. Okay. Right. There's got to be another spear somewhere. Cal, I understood the hint. Okay, right, so here's what I think we're gonna do. So, this ball, I'm gonna push it so it rolls down. And then, we're gonna get into that slot over there. Then, this ball over here, we're gonna get into that slot where that ball originally was. There we go. Okay, so this ball stays right here, and that's gonna raise up the platform, which is probably a part of the puzzle. Now, what we gotta do is we need to get this second ball to its slot, and hopefully, uh, expand the puzzle a little. Alright, let's get into the slot somewhere. Oh, that's new. Is it new? It's another platform. But oh, where does it lead? Oh, wait, no, it opens this door. Oh, no. Oh, it is. Right. There's more uh, Zephyr, right? Oh, it is. Alright, let's force machine. And there it goes. Alright then, so 
I'm assuming this is the way we need to go. Okay, so not only did the second ball unlock a platform, but also unlock a door. Or not unlock, unlocked ED, a door. I'm speaking so, I'm flubbing so much, you guys. We're making so many verbal mistakes. Ah, look, here's another ball right here. Okay, right. Right. So now that we force pushed it free, right, this should be another piece of the puzzle. Alright, so wind is blowing out that way. Alright, we need to get this third ball to another slot. We just need to figure out how to do that. Alright, let's get the ball out of the way first so it's not quite. Okay, right. That ball, it, it can't break. Okay, so I know that much. Alright, let's go ahead and, uh, I don't think we're gonna need the platform, so let's go ahead and remove this ball right here. Um, okay. Alright, I need to think. I don't think there's any place for this ball to go except for this slot right here. So maybe I'm not supposed to remove it. Let's go ahead and put it back where it was. Okay, right, so if this ball, this third one right here, that was supposed to be missing. Okay, so we can't break this. But there does appear to be a pathway over there. Right. Alright, let me go ahead and climb up on top of here. I'm gonna go ahead and save our progress so if we die, we don't lose that third ball. So we're gonna go ahead and actually wait before I save actually. <laughs> Guys, climb up here. Okay, we need to look from above. See, so there's a slot right there, but there's also a slot right there. Now the question is, which slot are we supposed to use? Oh wait. Okay, so maybe we can't use this slot, but it does look like you see that wind blowing up. Maybe we can push the ball so it rolls in this ramp. Okay, BD1? And maybe the air uh, shoots. Glad to hear. I think that's just what Cal says whenever I'm like, uh, whenever, uh, I don't know. Yeah, look, you guys see how this passageway is moving? Oh, well, maybe that's the key. Right, so let's go ahead and, uh, move this ball out of the way. Okay. So this pillar right here is blocking the way. So what if we get this ball and we get it to be in the passageway over here? supposed to do it's supposed to shoot that ball this ball right here into the air and when it does that it um, as a result causes um, the ball to shoot up and maybe it lands on the other platform on the other side hmm so let's give it a try maybe okay right, let's climb back up here let's go ahead and get this other ball into place let's go ahead and cut across let's go ahead and get this ball back into position but that's the only thing I can think of Alright, let's go ahead and get this over here. Oh no. Dang it, wrong direction. Darn it. Alright, let me see if I can stop the ball from going that way. I didn't mean to go to make it go this way. I meant to put it back in the slot, so that way the ball, other ball can shoot in the air. Hopefully that's what it is. Alright. Something? 
Maybe, I mean, obviously it has to unlock something, but the question is what? What did it just unlock? Okay. Oh look, there's an air pocket, like the one on the other side. Ah, look! So this unlocks the ramp. Okay, right, so now we can use one of the balls to go across. Okay, so I think I know what we should do. Okay, right, so first off, both of these balls have to stay in position. Oh, wait, I can't go through this ramp. Okay, so it's not meant for me, it's meant for the ball, so my prediction is correct. Okay, so right, what we need to do is we need to, first off, we gotta keep this ball in place right here, because it keeps this ramp open. And the other one, it leaves the other one open. And this apparently leads back. No, yeah, see? This is a pathway for another ball to go across and shoot up in the air, presumably to that other slot. Alright, so... We're gonna mess with this ball right here since it only opens this platform right here and I don't think it does anything else significant. So we're gonna go ahead and use this ball right here to see if it shoots up in the air. Alright. Now we're gonna go ahead and uh, push it. Alright, go ahead. We're gonna go ahead and push this ball so it enters this tunnel right here. So then it should shoot up in the air and then enter the pathway where the ramp is and then fly up in the air. Possibly. There's only one way to figure it out. Right. Let's see what happens. Yep, look, there it goes, there it goes. Alright, there goes the ball. It goes down the pathway, and then it should shoot out right here, right? I think? Yep! Alright, let's go ahead and climb up here. I think the next step is we need to slow down the ball and then get it into the slot. Yeah, look, right here. This is the key. So we gotta stand right here and slow the ball at the precise moment. Dang. You got in my way. Okay, right. So I figured out the puzzle. So what we need to do is we have to slow down the ball and then force push it into the slot right here. That way, something else will become unlocked. I think that's the key. Alright, so there goes the ball. It's going to shoot out from right here. So the idea is I need to slow it down. Alright, there we go. It's fine. I'm going to keep it slow. Damn it! Oh, I fell off the ramp. I was trying to get a good distance so I didn't get crushed by the ball. Damn, now we're going to have to wait for it to go back. Dang it. Okay, alright, there goes the ball. Okay, right, standing right here, I should be fine, hopefully. Alright, here comes the ball. Slow it. Dang it, what? It didn't work? Excuse me? I use force slow. I don't understand how, why it didn't work. Alright, but it's gonna come back out here again. So we're gonna go ahead and hopefully slow it down to this time. Alright. Oh, no. It's too late. Alright. Oh, no. Ah, oh, I got stuck. Dang it. Right, so we're gonna have to wait for it. So see, just the thing is, this takes precision and timing. So I not only have to be precise about how, where I slow the ball, but I also have to time it correctly, because if not, then all the fails that we've been having are gonna keep on repeating. All right, right here. All right, so force push. There we go. Oh, this rises. Look, it's going up. All right, so this is the next piece of the puzzle. Alright, let's figure out what this unlocked here. Alright. Alright. Oh, there's a platform. Can you climb it? We can. Awesome. Okay. Alright, we can force push this right here. There's another ball right here. Oh wait, this is the ball from the this is from the elevator, right? Okay. Right, so I think this is the end point. Alright, real quick, is there anything else here? Mm, nope. Doesn't appear like there's anything else here. I don't think. Okay, okay, right. We can force push this wall over here from the other side. We can't jump over. Alright, we're back in the elevator. So now, this is the entrance of the tomb, if I'm not mistaken. So, as you see, this wall, we can manipulate it now. We couldn't do it when we first entered the tomb in the previous episode. Right. So now, can we get it to break through? Because, um. Oh, wait, no. Okay, uh, I was trying to break this wall. No, I was supposed to get into that slot over there. I think that's what activates the elevator. Alright, let's see. Alright, force push it so it goes down. Alright, should be able to access the slot, right? Right? Yep. Now what? Did that do something? Did it activate the, did it activate the elevator? It did! Alright guys, we did it! We activated the elevator. And now we should be able to escape, right? Maybe? Are we trapped? Oh wait, there's a person trapped. There we go! What did you find? The Zephyr went to Kashyyyk. 
Cordova mentioned someone named Tarful. Well, I'm assuming he's a Wookiee. A Wookiee chieftain. Yep. They were old friends. Think he's still around? There's only one way to find out. We have to go to Kashyyyk. My thoughts exactly. Only problem is that next thing you know, it's um, occupied by the Empire. And that's the uh, worst of our concerns, I think. Right, guys, so we did it. We actually solved the puzzle. Nice. It may have taken us a while. It took me a long time in real time. It took me like about an hour to figure this out. But to you guys, it should have taken maybe 20 minutes, possibly. Um, I'm terrible at mental math, so don't quote me on this. But, right, so now we know our mission. So now, for our next, the next part of the mission, we have to go to Kashyyyk. And we have to find Cordova's friend, who probably not only really knows uh, about where Cordova went, but knows the next part of the we step. Just the right. Let's go ahead and meditate with the Force. Alright, let's go ahead and rest. Alright, life, Force, and Stim have been replenished. Okay. Let's go ahead and leave now. We don't have any Force points. Skill points, rather. The Empire. Right, now we gotta deal with the Empire. I see some stormtroopers around there, so we're gonna go ahead and deal with them in just a sec. Right, deal with these guys. Oh, whoa, these air, all these air pockets just opened. Can't believe it. Right, that takes care of him. All right, jump across. All right, let's play all that. Oh, it's a rocket trooper. Even more reason to give it. Right. Oh, what the heck? Did he just explode? You guys saw that, right? That that scout trooper just blew himself up. Right. Oh, this guy. Oh, I think there's another rocket trooper nearby. Oh yeah, I see him. He's right there. But his rockets are getting flung by the air. Go ahead, slay this guy. Oh. Okay, alright, let's go ahead and jump across. Alright, let's open this chest. Alright, VD, let's go ahead and have a look inside. Oh, alright then. What do we find? What's in there? New light table material. Awesome mirror rhythm. Awesome meridian. Oh. Oh no, no, no. I got this. Oh, I don't have a rocket. Maybe. You don't. Yeah. Oh wait, there's another one? Maybe? No, I think. Yeah, there's another rocket. Let's take care of him. Right. Thanks. Alright, let's climb up this here. Stop, intruder! Dang. Alright, that's not high enough. Okay. Like this. Oh! We can use the force on this. There's something in here? Oh, yeah, there's an echo of the force. Let's listen. Getting a strange feeling from this one. Ancient Zepho gathered here. I wonder why. Hmm. Many questions that we have yet to be answered, or that we have yet to have answers for. Alright. Let's go ahead and. Right. Oh no. Alright. Okay, right. Alright, let's go ahead and meditate with the force now, now that we're taking care of the stormtroopers. Let's go ahead and leave now. Okay. Right, BD. Let's go make our way back to the ship. Now that we know what we're looking for. What we're looking for, rather. Alright. Alright. Open this. Okay. Right. Now. Is there anything in here? Oh yeah, look. There's an echo of the force. Let's listen. Is this? Continue excavating. I want rare artifacts, not useless trinkets. Literally, one of the most annoying things about the Empire is their officers. I, I, I never liked officers. They were always so annoying, especially with their British voices. They were, all, uh, they were especially so demanding too, like, Oh, I expect it to be done the first time or something like that. Basically, they don't give stormtroopers a break. So I at least have a bit of sympathy for the Empire, though. It doesn't skew the atrocities that they can Alright, that was pretty cool. I just shattered that whole wall. Let's go ahead and wall run. Right here. Right here. Grab this rope. And then we should be able to swing across. And then we should meditate with the force, yes? Alright. 
Alright, we made it. Now let us meditate with the force. Yeah, ice caves. Alright, let us meditate. Okay, now that that's done, we can leave now. Okay, right. Now let's go ahead and head up here. What? What is that? Oh god, there's like a monster. We don't got time. Oh, we don't got time to deal with that. Ah! Ah! Alright, we need to get away from this thing. Alright, come on. Slice this rope. Ah! Alright, let's get out of here. Slide in, slide in. Ah! Oh no, more. Ah! Alright, another rocket trooper right here. Alright. Ah. Oh! Ah! Oh, oh. Alright, there's a switch. What if we. Can we do anything with it? I guess not. Hmm. Okay, we're right across from where we slid across. Alright, let's go ahead and wall run over here. Let's see where this leads. Alright, oh shoot. Dang it. Wait. Wall run. Wall run. Wall run. Okay. Oh no, it's another one. Slow it down. Alright, there goes your horn. Alright, baby. Yeah. Better since I, I don't have time to deal with monsters. Alright. This air should boost us up, allowing us to wall run even further. Okay. Now where are we? Mm, I guess our only way is to keep wall running. Okay, right. Wait, what? Wait a minute! Ah! Whoa! Got it! Not enough. Uh, guys, do you guys recognize that trooper? That's the same trooper that was with the Inquisitor. Those like new black storm troopers. They're called purge troopers, right? From what I saw in the subtitles. Damn, so we got our R speed by freaking purge trooper. I wasn't expecting that. I didn't know purge troopers were going to be here. Probably sent by the second sister or the ninth sister or whatever. Point is, the Inquisitors know we're here, which is bad. Which means, we need to leave Zeppo as soon as possible. If not, then we'll be jeopardizing the mission. And probably the lives of Seer and, um, the captain. I forgot his name. I think it was Grief, right? Right, we're back here again. Okay. Let's go and open this. Alright, this unlocks a shortcut. Which is good. Alright, let's meditate with the Force. Now let's go ahead and leave. Okay, right. Now that that's done, let's go ahead and make a... What is it, BD? Something to scan? What'd you find? Scout the triple patrol. Alright. Go ahead and force push that thing off. Alright, we're back at the Mantis. Now let's make our way back. Whoa! Cal, we've oh. got a walker firing on us, and our weapons oh, are down! Oh no! Oh great. Tell him he better are you get kidding me? Great, we have to do an ATST? Alright then, looks like we're fighting this thing. Yep. We're gonna have to fight an ATST. Alright, oh shoot. Alright. Yeah. Wait, what's that? Oh, that's a bomb! Alright, that thing is firing bombs. We gotta be careful. Hold on, those are shock Those are like shock grenades. Ah! Ah, I think he's shooting me. Need a stem. Alright. Alright, we need to try to find some cover. Cause that thing has wait. Ah! That thing has heavy weapons. Maybe we can use some of these crates to weaken it. Nope. Uh, uh, Stab. Ah. I right, stand. Right. Ah. Right. Oh, that's not that's not doing anything. Okay, right. 
And yes, I apologize for the abrupt jump cut, but I did deal with the walker. I am sorry though. For the, for the nice work cut. out there, kid. Hey, you got some real moves on you. <laughs> Just tell me that this visit wasn't for nothing. It's I not. found the tomb of a Zepho sage. They definitely used the force. An advanced civilization of force wielders who mysteriously vanished. No wonder Master Cordova became so obsessed with them. What else did you find? Before they disappeared, the Zeppo journeyed to the planet Kashyyyk. Oh. Cordova had a Wookiee friend named Tarful. Maybe we can find him. Kashyyyk, I look, things are really bad down there. The, the Empire's muscling in on those I Wookiees knew it. big time. Then we better get ready for a fight. Oh. I knew it. So the Empire is occupying uh, I think this Kashyyyk. lifestyle suits you. Fighting that walker seems to have made you more confident. Maybe. So, how are you holding up? I mean, with the Force? Yes, with the Force. I know you said it could be overwhelming. I haven't gotten myself killed yet. I'd rather not talk about it. Yeah, well, I understand. You're More than you realize. Anyone. Why'd you choose to stop using the Force? When the Purge started, and our... Clone troops turned against us. My pattern and I took six. several younglings and we went into hiding. I knew it. We didn't last long. Why is that? Imperial patrol was about to discover our location, so I tried to lure them away from my Padawan Trilla. She stayed behind with the younglings. But they caught me. And they tortured me. They wanted to know about the others and how many were left, but Mostly they wanted to know about Cordova and where he went. But you escaped. Yeah. It was a prison riot. I saw my opportunity and I took it. But they almost broke me. And I am not the same as I was, Cal. Your Padawan. She did? Did she survive? No. But that's why we can't give up. We can't let the sacrifice of those closest to us be for nothing. I see. So, Sears Apprentice died, right? Okay. All right, let's have a look here. Any new plants? New sea planet, yep. Calpy, Royal Flues, Gillypod. And that's all the plants that we have for right now. Alright then, let's go ahead and have a look. First off, let's meditate with the Force. And then, we'll go ahead and have a look at our new lightsaber parts. Let's see what we got. Alright, let's leave. Let's go ahead and do that. I don't have any more skill points. Or, actually, let's rest. Yeah, since I don't think I have any more stems, I wasn't gonna keep them count. Right. Now that that's done, let's have a look at our new lightsaber parts, see if we can change anything on our saber. For the moment. Okay, right. Let's begin. Let's put my saber here. Let's have a look at it. Alright, color, um, emitter, um, right. We only have the main three. Nothing's different here, I don't think. They all look the same. Yeah, pretty much. Alright, switch. Uh... Duty and Resolve. Is this a new switch? I can't remember. Alright, we're gonna keep it the same, I think. Alright, now the sleeve. This is new, I think. I think as well as this. Elemental Nature. That's definitely a Star Wars Galaxy's Edge sleeve. And a nod to Galaxy's Edge as in general. Okay. Right. I think we're gonna keep it the same for right now. We're gonna keep it of uh, Valor and Wisdom. Alright, now the material. That is new. Okay. We have alloy metal, which is what it was originally. Um, okay. My Guido campaign is what we were already equipped. Umbarian campaign. We have copper, dura steel, silverian iron, osmerid, osmeridium. Um, I think we're gonna switch to dura steel, maybe. Since it looks silver, but it's not like a like a chrome. It's like a brushed silver. I think that looks uh, good to be uh, fair. Not sure why elemental nature looks like that. Yeah, we're gonna keep the sleeve we already had. Alright, now for the switch. Um, 
I think we're gonna keep this the same as well. Yeah, I, I think we're gonna keep it the same. The emitter, definitely we're gonna keep it the same. Since uh, unless we get like some new flashy emitter, then um, I think we're gonna keep it that way. And yeah, we're gonna keep it blue. I think we're gonna keep the, we're still gonna keep the Kyber Crystal blue until we find some new ones. That is, I just like trying to really think about this about my saber parts. Because next thing you know, there's one that I like and I didn't realize that I liked. Who knows, right? Yeah, but for right now, um, I think the one that I already have uh, selected is uh, the best one. Gallery Wisdom 2. Same with the sleeve. Alright, so I, I think we should be fine. Alright, we're gonna keep our Kyber Crystal blue. Or if maybe, maybe later on in the series I'll decide to change it. Who knows? Alrighty. Now. Let's meditate with the force once again. Actually, you know what? Let's go ahead and just like get right right to it. There's a long journey ahead of us. Right. Yeah, so we need to get you the machine. and me, we're unstoppable together. Brother, BD, let's use the hull too. Let's pick our next destination. Right. So, we could go back to Bogano whenever we want. We still have to go to Dasimir eventually, but we're not gonna go right now. Um, especially since I, how I felt about it in the last episode, how I uh, confirmed you about it. Right, so, um, what I'm thinking we should do is, um, we should head directly to Kashyyyk. So, what? I've heard. Right. Travel to plan. Travel. Right. Kashyyyk is where we're going. Right then. What? What? What is that thing saying? I don't know why people have droids. Well, he's my droid. Tell that to him. He can understand. Yes. He can? Yes. Look, I think I, I talked to him. I didn't mean anything by it. Droids just freak me out. All right, here what we go, doesn't? guys. You sound like an M. They deactivate droids just because they can. All right. That makes him I can light speed. us. Huh. Oh. Tough break. I take it back. You're all right, buddy. Right then. So we just need to rent. Time to land. Get up here. All right then. Looks like we're at Kashyyyk already. Oh no! There's a bunch of star stories everywhere. Tell me we're not running that blockade. Oh, yeah, I only know. as a last resort. I've rigged the Mantis' transponder to transmit Imperial signals. Hey, Grease. Oh, yeah. nice. Keep your power signature low and act like we belong. Just like Bracca. No sweat. Just like Bracca. I don't need another set of hands. Just please keep your eye on the scanner. All please. right. All right. All right. I kind of thought that was a high five for a second there, but... I don't see yeah. anything. The preoccupied with something on the ground. We're clear. Right then, let's head directly for Kachik. Empire is devouring Kashyyyk for its natural resources. Of course it is. Okay, so been enslaved. And I'm going displaced. to place it. Right then, we just need to find out uh, where our Tarful is at. The question is. Oh, oh, that was a close one, kid. Aren't you supposed to be watching the monitors? Gorilla fighters. Wookiees and off-worlders and bushing an Imperial convoy. Well, and that was. Walker's approaching their position. Tarful could be with him. Awful could be anywhere, like deep in the ground, like we're gonna be if we get caught up in that battle down there. We don't have any other options, and, and we'll die without our help. So what's your plan? It's the right thing to do. Sabotage. We use the scrap walkers on Braca. I'll just jack one. <laughs> get a load of the kid. He thinks we're back in a Clone Wars. Captain, uh, get us near those walkers. Wait, what? Listen, <laughs> those walkers double as troop transport, so once you get inside, be careful. Right. No freeze grease to work as magic. Hey, do me a favor. What's that? Stay alive down there. I'll add it to the plan. Right then. I guess I'll see you around, sir. Well, guys, looks like we're stealing your walkers. Right if you're jumping, you better do it now, kid. 
Ready, ready, ready. 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 Alright, buddy. Let's make a dive. Right then, so. That was clearly an old uh, Republic gunship, if you guys recognize that. Ugh. Right then. So. <laughs> Whoa. Great so what? Ah. So we're still ready to do this? Walker, huh? Right then. Looks like that's not too Oh, shoot. Oh yeah guys, if you recognize that, or if you watch ah. Clone Wars, that's a Republic gunship, which is probably one of the most iconic ships in all of Star Wars. Yes, I said that. Okay, right. So, we need to get on one of these walkers, these at -AT walkers, and use it against the Empire. Right? No problem. Okay, well, let's go ahead and do that. Right. I think we're gonna, we should be able to climb on Maybe this, we can uh, get up there. Left leg, right? Yeah, my thoughts are exactly. Okay, right. Let's see if we can get close enough to it. Or... Alright, let's try this again. Maybe we don't see this one, actually. Or do we? Nope, yeah, we definitely do. Okay, right, so... We need to figure out where to climb. Alright, here's good. Right, right? Yeah, we can climb on this thing easy. Right, you don't even notice a bit of uh, way change that's from, right? AT-AT walkers are perfect. Well, actually, I don't even know what to say. Alright. Let's get on its leg. Okay. Now where? Right. Oh, no, that's cool. Okay, so we're gonna wanna jump to the side right here. Maybe. Come on. There we go, yeah. Ideally, we're gonna wanna do this. We wanna drop this to our right. Then we can climb up on its head. Okay, I think that's the idea. Let's finish this. Right. But there's the cockpit. <laughs> don't want to be sitting in the Thanks, fire. BD. Right. We're practically on the AT-80 -AT Walker's chin right here. Cover. Hey, look. It's an AT-80 -AT with a beard. All right, but seriously, though. Climb to the stuff. top. Right. Now, we should be able to climb up. That's what I'm doing. Oh. I didn't have to kill him. The gunship killed him. Too. Okay. Right, we're in the walker. This is the first time I've ever seen the inside of a walker. Okay. Now what? Oh, there's a speeder bike. Can we use it? Oh, wait, there's an opening right there. Maybe that's what's gonna do. There we go. Right. Now, I'm pretty sure this is the front. Right? There's no pulse! Alright, there's a door. Your turn to report fatalities. It's the Jedi! Incoming threat! You don't feel like the Empire. I can't fight anymore! Right. Go ahead and slay these guys. Alright. Nice. We got rid of all of them. Okay, right. Now what? Oh, we can open this. Reading a new ship on scanners. They brought right. more firepower than we thought. How's our hull looking? Badly damaged. We're at 70% integrity in falling. Uh, BD. Do me a favor, give the nice trippers a distraction, eh? Alright. Uh, 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 it actually worked. Alright, BD. Now let's go ahead and try this. Report, thing, yeah? what's happening over there? You're in violation of Imperial Protocol. Shut that guy up. Stand down or we won't have. Okay. Alright. <laughs> let's do this. Right, right. Now. Oh no, they took out the gunship. Alright. Now we can So those are the blasters. Blasters. No, let's find You said it. I think I'm gonna go. Yeah. Let's move forward. There it goes. Okay, right. I think that's the Empire. Hey! Who are oh, you? Oh, what the hell? Who's this? Someone just brought Nada to the table. Oh wait, what the Saw Gerrera? What? Damn. Yeah, I'm okay. You all right? 
No, we are not doing that again. Definitely not. And you I just noticed the um, perfectly good walk. I didn't expect to see name? you here, Saw. Cal Kestis. Saw Guerrero. What are you doing, Real, Kashyyyk? Like, looking for somebody. What are you doing here? My companions and I came to Kashyyyk to disrupt and pill supply lines. That's so. Hey! Thank you guys, I want to see you from behind. My captain provides the front of the line. So, who are you looking for? A Wookiee chieftain named Tarful. Tarful is impossible to find. There's a reason he's evaded the Empire for this long. He's a freedom fighter? He's THE freedom fighter. A symbol of the Wookiee resistance. Striking at the Empire from the Shadowlands. Huh. Seer, Grease, this is Saw. How you doing? What do you want with Tarful? Jedi business. The Jedi are dead. Not all of them. Not me. <clears throat> Get that over corpse? It was given to me by my master. I survived Order this 66. This supports an Imperial refinery that Appreciate. runs on Wookiee slave labor. Intel suggests that some of the captains there are guerrilla fighters. I should help That's them. So. One of them might know how to contact Tarful. It's possible. Whoa, wait a minute, hold on, wait a minute. The Manus works wonders. I mean, it's a great ship, excellent pilot, but it is not built for close support. We'll stay here and monitor Imperial transmissions. With a bit of luck, we'll intercept any distress calls. Appreciate it. My lieutenants and I will scout ahead to prepare the attack. Join us when you're ready. Right go, go. So, saw Guerrero's in this game too. That's a surprise. Right then, you guys. So, we're on Kashyyyk, and I'm 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 sorry that you guys didn't get to see uh, uh, more of me. Um, Freaking um, piloting the AT-80 walker. It really does suck that you guys didn't get to see that because of the abrupt cut. But uh, yeah, our AT-80 eventually got shot. Let's just say that. All right now, let's go ahead and meditate with the forces. Because um, this is where we're gonna end the episode. All right, you guys. So first off, let's access the skill tree real quick. All right, let's go ahead and get this one. Enhanced survival skills. Cal's maximum life is increased. Alright guys, so that's gonna wrap up this video. So, that's what happened in this episode. We escaped the temple, we're in Kashyyyk, and now we're gonna free some Wookiee slaves from the Empire. So as usual, links in the description down below for my DeviantArt and Discord server. So if you're interested in checking out either, the links will be in the description down below. And if you guys liked the video, be sure to smash the like button, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.